This right here is the Short Stash Everyday Filter, and we gotta talk about this thing because it is a game changer. Now, I actually got to see a sneak peek of this late last year from the man himself, and ever since then, I have been waiting to get my hands on it. Then a few days ago, they showed up at my door, and already, just using it for the past few days, I can already tell you it will be living on my camera till further notice. And truthfully, there's not another filter out on the market right now that's quite like this. You have the best of both worlds, a circular polarizer and a pro mist filter. But before before I explain that, let me give a little bit more context. This is a collaboration between Short Stash and Polar Pro. If you guys aren't familiar with Polar Pro, they make a ton of dope products for creatives. One that's super popular is the Variable ND filter. That's a collaboration with Peter McKinnon. If you've seen anyone rock this gold filter, that's exactly what this is. It's one of the best Variable ND filters out on the market. They've done a few iterations at this point. This has been my go-to ND filter for the past, I don't know, three years or ever since it came out. And honestly, most creators I know have one of these ND filters. It's super premium, crazy high quality, and the gold is sick. So that's Polar Pro. But Short Stash, in case you live under a rock, is one of the most talented photographers or really creatives in the world. Like if there was a battle royale of photographers to save the world, I would put my money on Short Stash every single day of the week. This dude is elite level talent, has a signature, very distinct look, and just one of the best dudes ever. Short Stash, AKA Garrett, is the real deal. So for his filter, which which I have a few of them right here. I'll show you guys in a second. They brought in the best of both worlds, a circular polarizer as well as a pro mist filter. Circular polarizers have been around for a long time. I'm sure you guys are probably already familiar with. They're really popular for a variety of creators. One niche, for example, is car photography. It helps get rid of some of those reflections and windows. It's also really popular in the lifestyle or portrait photography world. And then as far as a pro mist filter goes, that is my go-to filter for honestly both video and photo. I have one on my camera that I'm filming on right now. I have a Pro Mist on my Fuji, on my Leica. Truthfully, most of the time I always have a Pro Mist on. It helps give you that slight cinematic look and feel to your images. It gives a very slight soft look to your subject as well as any highlights in your image. It gives that nice glow or blooming effect. Like if you look at the lights behind me, they have a very subtle glow to them. That's exactly what a Pro Mist does and I personally love that look. So when he told me what this filter was, oh man, I was so hyped. And then I used it and I was even more hyped. But why am I explaining it when we can just hear from him. The short stash filter is a filter that I wanted to make that would combine two of the most leading things that people want. One in particular is a circular polarizer uh, that I always had on my camera. It never left, it acts as a lens cap for me, protects all my glass, and of course, just everything I use at all times. So that being said, it was always nice to maybe have like a subtle bit of like mist, diffusion, bloom, however you wanna say it, in the highlights. And I thought that, you know, with this subtle mist uh, combined with the polarizer would just act as like a two-in-one combo that didn't exist. So the money green, the olive tones, and everything uh, is just so on brand for uh, both the level of product for Polar Pro and then also just the short stash brand. So really hyped on it. Um, the filter works as a normal polarizer and the diffusion comes out when there's light and then it doesn't when there's not. So it's there when you need it and it's course gone when you don't. So it's perfect, man. It's a perfect two in one and hope you enjoy it. This filter is awesome. And it really is called the everyday filter because it works well for everyday use and in a ton of different situations. So let's talk about the unboxing experience and what you actually get if you purchase one of these and pick it up. So this right here is the box it comes in. We got that nice photo of Garrett on the front every day. And then obviously your filter size. I don't know off the top of my head, all the different filter sizes it comes in, but it is a variety, not just 82 millimeters. I also have I have a couple 49 millimeters sitting here too. One's actually right here um, on my Fuji. But on the back of the box, Short Stash Polar Pro, everyday filter, a ton of little details on the box, which is very Garrett. So this box slides out like that. And then once you open it up, inside here, you got a little Polar Pro card. And then what we're really here for is this right here. So you pull that out. This is a nice little case it comes with to protect and hold your filter. Maybe it's in your camera bag, etc. And then this, nice little detail. This right here, you go ahead and open this up here. Right here, we got a nice premium lens cloth, Polar Pro logo over there, short stash logo over here. Let's be real, we all need to do this. You probably need to wipe your lens right now. So it's nice that comes with that. And then the main event right here, we have the case. Again, it's all in the details. You got every day up top, obviously Polar Pro logo there. Down here, you got your thread size. And then even right here, another short stash logo. Open it up and there you go. This thing is 
absolutely gorgeous. And I love having this because in case you're switching filters or traveling, whatever, you can throw it right back in this, have it in your camera bag and you know it's protected. And that's really nice because, you know, Polar Pro isn't the cheapest brand out there, but it's extremely good quality and it feels very, very premium. I truthfully swear by it. I've used their products before. This is not paid. I'm genuinely just making this because Garrett's a homie and they make awesome products. Okay, so the filter itself though, right? You kind of have that signature color that is known for Garrett, which is that olive green. You know, that Peter McKinnon one has that gold look. Garrett's is that olive green and it looks so good. Even like the mirrored reflection to it has a green tint, which is so sick. Even on the filter, if you guys can see this, we got short stash on one side, every day on one side, and then the thread side on another. And then when you put this thing on your lens and camera, it just looks so good. I've been carrying around my Fuji X100V for the last few days since I picked this up, just snapping a handful of photos with it to test this thing out. And already I love the way it looks. The images I've been getting out of this camera with this filter, I've been in love with. This for me is gonna replace my Pro Mist filters. You still get all the detail, but that nice bloom effect from the mist, as well as having the capability of having that circular polarizer is such a nice combo. I see why he named it the Everyday Filter because this is perfect for everyday use. I have it on my 82 millimeter, which is perfect for the 16 to 35 or even the 24 to 70, which are like my two go-to lenses. And then that 49 millimeter is perfect on the Fuji X100V. Actually right now I'm waiting on the X106 to get in, the Leica Q2 or Q3 even. And let's be real, this thing also looks sick just on your camera. I'm very much from the world of the look good, feel good, play good. And it's no different with your camera gear. I like to be excited about picking up the camera to go capture content. Having this filter is gonna help me achieve the look I want out of my images. I know it's well made. I know it's premium. It's really what you want out of a product when you pick it up. Now, real quick, I want to say something about Garrett. I've personally been in this content game for a long time. I've been doing photo and video work for over 10 years. I've been doing personal content for a little over four. I've met creators with millions of followers all the way to people just starting out. Professionals, amateurs, everyone in between. And late last year, Garrett and myself with a few other creators were part of an awesome event out in Utah. Shout out to Landon and Tom. But that was the first time we met in person. And without a doubt, Garrett is one of the most talented creative minds I've ever met. But also he's one of the most humble creators I've ever met. He constantly was interested in hearing other people's stories. And he's one of those people that when he speaks, or even if you just look at his work, it motivates you to level up your game. Like even him sending these filters out to me. Zero expectations to make any sort of content. And that's kind of what this entire space is about. Being motivated or inspired by each other. And supporting good human and awesome creators. So when I heard about the Short Stash Polar Pro collab, to me, that is such an amazing thing. So is this product amazing? Yes, but truly, and I mean it, the people behind it are even better. I always try to make it a point to support other creators, whether it be commenting on their content or picking up a shirt from their clothing drop, or for this, picking up people's filters. And this isn't a sales pitch and that's not what this is intended to be. If you don't pick this up, great. But if you do, I genuinely think you're gonna like it. I love it for my work and I think you would too. But also you get to support an amazing creator, a really cool brand with Polar Pro, but more importantly, a really good, genuine dude who truly cares about other creators in this space. And that's someone I definitely wanna back up and support. So Garrett, if you're watching this, shout out to you, man. Thank you for sending this out early. I actually promise you guys, this thing will be living on my camera till further notice. So yeah, I could go on forever, but the short stash everyday filter will be available. First link down in the description if you guys wanna pick it up for yourself. Drop me any questions you guys got down in the comments below. Feel free to go over to my IG and check out some of the photos that I'll be taking over the coming weeks. And I will catch you guys in the next video very, very soon. Peace guys.